I was invited to go to Dollywood with some of the YouTubers from the Chili Cook-Off, and I thought it might be really fun. It also might be interesting to watch how they do things so that I can improve how I bring these videos out and how I make these videos so that I can make vid better videos for you guys. I know you really would appreciate that. Of course I got here too early because I didn't listen to my wife this time. But now that I'm here, I walked around for a moment outside and I'm trying to figure out whether or not I should take my jacket with me. It doesn't feel too cold and it's probably only going to get a little warmer, but it is 40 degrees so if I'm outside a lot I might start to feel a little chilly. But if I take my jacket then I have to carry it around all day and I have to deal with it all day. It's quite the conundrum, huh? We are in Dollywood. As you can see I forgot my good camera. Well I didn't forget it, I actually decided not to bring it out and once I forgot it. I didn't bring my good camera because I didn't know what I was going to get into or what the weather was going to be like. I didn't want to mess it up. This is the pond where Mindy and I used to come and look at the turtles. They have several turtles in there. And you know we love turtles. So now I think that it's a little cold for them to be out. But we'll see if I see any today. I'll let you guys know. Definitely not getting the fish food because I'm sure you guys know I'm not a fan of fish. And if you don't, then you know it now. It's a beautiful fountain though. They do have great cinnamon bread here, but as you know, I can't eat it. I gotta be good. Oh, peer pressure. It's worth it. I hope. We'll try and get on the train now. As long as the line's not too long. Hey, I'll just keep on waving and being friendly with everybody. Howdy, Ashley. t-shirt from somewhere. You have to help me figure out why I need to put on it. The juggler. Although you can probably see him on about 10 different videos today. They sure are. Alright, I got this Mothman t-shirt at the Mothman Festival itself. But it was given to me by the owner of the International Paranormal Museum in Somerset, Kentucky because I went and did a video at his place. Someone else saw that video and donated him a piece of the original uh, bridge that collapsed from the, from the Mothman disaster. And so he was so thankful that, he, that I helped him obtain that piece for his museum that he gave me this shirt for free. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> that's a great shirt. Thanks. Out here to see Dolly. Quite a few people. She has a diva lap. One, two, three. Check one, two. Test one, two. Check. Test one, two. Dollywood in 
enjoying seeing this tree and I'm enjoying seeing you watch me see this tree. <laughs> I'm sure you're going to get some pretty big shots with my head up in the air. Woohoo! Is that it? Oh, good. No? I guess not. Well, it's still shining. Anyway, I don't know if that's the end of the tree or not, but this is the end of me. Because you know what I'm doing? I'm going to get on the bus and I'm heading to, uh, to Atlanta. It's beautiful after dark around here, that's for sure. of people out of Dollywood after the parade's over. Now I'm hearing the traffic's really bad getting home. We'll see how that goes. I'll be glad to get home tonight. That was an awesome day. I had a whole lot of fun hanging out with those guys and girls. I learned a lot too, so hopefully that'll help me make these even better. As you saw, I had to film with my phone because I didn't take my camera with me. So I'm sure that the sound and audio isn't as good as it should be. Hopefully, my next video, I'll be back on track with my using my good camera. It's the battery if it's charging right now, so I can't really use it to film this final segment either. I don't know if you noticed, but I took my little kitty with me. If you've been following me on Instagram, you've seen this kitty shirt before because I posted it there. And if you're not, then you should be. Mindy's comment was that I hope it doesn't grow into a full-size cat because then it won't fit in my pocket. I tried to make my video today different from everybody else's that was there so I had tried to have a few different things than them I cut my video on Dolly short and on the parade a little bit short because a lot of people were there that were covering it a lot better than me if you would like to see more of that footage just let me know if you did want to see more of the parade or more of Dolly then go check out the other youtubers that were there they all have really great channels and they're actually a lot more experienced than I am so they probably got a lot better video I do want to thank all the YouTubers that I was able to hang out with today. They were a lot of fun and I learned a lot from them. And they're very down to earth and great people. I was there with Yankee in the South, who's Will and Don. I was there with Tennessee Matt. I was there with Jacob the Carpetbagger. I was there with Adam the Woo. And I want to give a special thanks to NTL Vlogs, Michael and Becca, because they're the ones that actually invited me personally to go along and I really appreciated that. It was a very fun day and I really enjoyed being there. One person that we missed that wasn't able to make it due to a work commitment was OVZ, Odin Von Zero. He has a great channel as well and he is a really good guy too. I guess I'm going to wrap this up. I do appreciate you guys watching this with me. Next time we'll see what we can get into because I think I'm going to try and get out two or three videos this week because I have so much stuff that I need to get out and I have a few things going on. I really do appreciate you guys, and I will see you next t-shirt. It was cold, and I'm very glad to be home to my roaring fire. <laughs> <laughs>